everyone, thanks for tuning in. Let's learn from number 10 of this Kyoten, words to uh, words for not turning into yokai. And I quote, Yokai consider it a great success if they can show themselves to be more than they are. Thank you very much. A couple things went through my mind. To show themselves more than they are and the definition of success. So showing themselves to be more than they are. A lot of the times, if you have a yokai tendency, uh, the tendency to cheat, the tendency to manipulate, the tendency to just make your outer appearance look good, but your inside isn't actually changing, uh, what happens is that you, don't, you, lose so you lose sight of your true self. So you lose sight of an objective evaluation of your level of enlightenment or your level of capacity or how well you can do in work. So, um, I think this is an objective sentence. They're showing themselves to be more than they are. But a lot of the times, yokai are believing that they are that much. But they're actually not. So that was the first thing that uh, caught my attention. The second part is the first part of the sentence. Yokai considered a great success if blah, blah, blah. So, I think this goes to how you define success. Each person's definition of success is pretty different, actually. And depending on the definition of success, because we, you know, subconsciously want to achieve success innately from the bottom of our souls, the definition is very important because that's going to be your goal, right? E even if you make great efforts, if the direction is wrong, you will lose the battle. So definition of success, I think, is crucial. Um, if you really want to know the Alcantara's true definition of success, I recommend you reading The Laws of Success. It is incredible. Very poetic, so it touches your heart, and it definitely comes from God. It's such divine power, divine words that define success in a form of eternal love, eternal prosperity, eternal challenges, eternal growth. He uses the word eternal for the definition of success. Usually, the te uh, yokai way of success is there's a cap to it. So I've already achieved. So you become uh, arrogant, right? Arrogant and ignorant. So then it stops. Your effort stops and you just start showing it off and you start wanting to use your power to control other people. But Master always uses the term eternal when, it define when he defines success. So it's never ending. It's a goal towards becoming like God, the Almighty. So, of course, we'll never get there, but that's the whole point. We, we, that is why we can continue making efforts forever, and we can continue improving ourselves forever, which means, in the truest sense, we can love ourselves in, in the real meaning. We'll find real sustaining happiness. Like, yokai happiness, yokai success, is not lasting. And it's not true form of happiness it doesn't last forever that's what we have to awaken to and we have to shift our paths our of our discipline the destination of the definition of success to what master is saying it's not about showing yourself to be great but it's to be truly great to truly go through transformation so that you can be a capable person who can truly help other people with a selfless heart uh, and in order to, you know, grasp this, genuine faith in the earth God, the supreme God, is crucial. Now those are my thoughts. What does it think? Leave your thoughts in the comment section. And see you again tomorrow. Bye.